Christopher Dudas Koch is only one of a number of criminals the United States wants to try. United States Assistant Secretary of State Arturo Valenzuela, while in Jamaica on a tri-nation Caribbean visit, said this week the United States has handed in a series of extradition requests for suspected Jamaican criminals to the Jamaican government. But he did not reveal any names. Valenzuela also made a push for greater effectiveness of the proceeds of the Crime Act to defeat organized crime in Jamaica. Medical evidence now suggests a Trinidad-born mom in Staten Island murdered her children. Lakeisha Jones, whose charred body was pulled from a Staten Island home along with her three children last week, may have been responsible for the fiery murder-suicide. The blame was initially pointed to 14-year-old CJ, who police initially believed had slashed the throats of his two sisters, setting fire to the apartment before slitting his own throat. But medical evidence this week suggested that Jones may have been the killer since soot was found in her lungs and the lungs of her two-year-old son Jermaine, showing they died of smoke inhalation. None was found in the lungs of CJ and his two sisters, Melanie 7 and Brittany 9. Will Wyclef Jean run for president of Haiti? Blogs and entertainment sites were abuzz this week with rumors that the Haitian-born Grammy Award-winning star turned ambassador at large could run for the top post. The former Fuji's leader has been at the forefront of relief efforts for the Caribbean since January 12th. With elections set in the country for November 28th, the rumor mill has been buzzing that Jean may consider throwing his hat in the ring. But so far, his family has released a statement saying that John has not announced his intent to run for Haitian president. But if and when a decision is made, the media will be alerted immediately. John, for his part, has insisted his only aim currently is to urge the young population to vote. In sports, a Bajan-born world champion has dominated the sprint hurdles in the 21st Central American and Caribbean Games. Ryan Brathwaite proved he is in good form as he ran unchallenged in the 110-meter hurdles to take the goal in a time of 13.39 in Puerto Rico. For more Caribbean news, log on to caribworldnews.com for your daily updates. And that concludes our News of the Week.